Alright folks, Pitching Ace 88, Knights of the Old Republic uh, walkthrough, part 132. This one we will defeat Malak. Uh, I will show you guys me dying multiple times, but as you can see here, I just, I, I, I practiced this and I played it and I made sure I saved at certain parts. Uh, because incredibly, if you play this game long enough, you can get some lucky hits in. Uh, and so right in this one, I have him down to very low health, and we'll do that one, but since I'm sure you guys want to see how I did it in the last one, I'm going to try and do it, but if I can't, if I die a couple times in this, in my, in game 36, I'll move to this one, and then I'll move to this one, and then I'll move to this one, but a lot of this is luck, so let's just try this. Okay, I have no idea how long this will take, but I'm trying to think of what I actually what I actually did. I spammed some uh, med packs. I think I gave myself one more and then ran away from him. Run away, run away. Have him hit you and then keep healing. Heal and then run. Heal and then run. Heal, heal and then and then I'll pause. And then I would I would advise to not use anything other than just what you regularly have. Uh, make sure force immunity is on because that'll kill you. I mean, look at this. I mean, I die so quickly. I I don't understand this. So I'm just gonna be showing you guys me dying multiple times so that you know how hard this is. I mean, this this is absolutely ridiculous. And the reason that it was three minutes between the other two is because I couldn't believe how far I was getting in this. And I kept dying like this over and over and over again. And then finally I got lucky a couple times. And so, I, I mean, I, I still can't believe that I got as far as I did. Uh, I'm going to probably spam a couple of these. And then he's coming faster than normal. So, I mean, I don't understand this. I don't understand this game at all. I, I think I also gave myself some other stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah. I gave myself an Achani shield later. You'll see that. And I put some Sith power gauntlets, which gave me a little bit more power. Uh, so what I would do is I would put this on. And then I'd try and hit him. And just hopefully get lucky, you know? Okay, now I'm just going to run. So hopefully you can just kind of run away from him. Now, I was reading in the in the walkthrough guide or whatever, and what it happens is every time he uses his force powers, once he gets down to a certain amount, he ends up uh he ends up uh charging himself up. So I I, I don't know why I didn't use force jump. So you just gotta kind of hopefully you hit him. Ah! And I died with really close to de defeating him. So I'm gonna load the game again. We're gonna try this one more time, and if it doesn't work, we're gonna go to the my successful attempt at this. And in case you're wondering, Force Wave does absolutely nothing. I'm going to try an adhesive grenade. Maybe that will stop him from moving. You just really got to just do trial and error. So this actually seems to be working fairly well. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw one more. Get him to stop, and then hopefully this will work. There we go. This looks like it's working pretty well. This is not what I used before, so if you're wondering, uh, I just decided to do try this out. There we go. So, now they did that, quickly pause, and 
just spam this as much as I can. So there's two more. I think my next save is when he's actually used two of them because I got really lucky. So, um, so oh, you know what I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna put on some battle stimulants. Always put on force immunity. That that'll help because he likes to he likes to uh, immobilize you, and that 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 can be a pain. But I'm going to actually try what I did the the last time, and actually I'm going pretty fast, so good. Okay, now what I'm going to try and do is attack him. And as I've mentioned before, this is basically just kind of luck. I mean, you, you sometimes get them. Hopefully I can get him before he kills me. Oh, there we go. And then try and do it away from the uh, where the last thing is that he's going to. Okay, so I think this is the last one, actually. And this is where I saved, so this is where exactly where I would actually come back to if I were to do that. Um, use some stim packs while he's trying to run towards you. Okay, and then force immunity. I should, you know, I should have done. I should. Oh, that was nice. Hopefully I can get him with with all the battle stimulus. Maybe I can hit him harder. Nice. So, ooh. Okay, okay, okay. So, actually, I might actually be able to defeat him without using any of my other stuff. So, and then the, the med packs are actually healing a little bit uh, better than the other ones are. So I'm actually going to try and net tackle him right here. And I did it. Wow. No way. That is awesome. Impossible. I, I cannot I think the audio is working and everything. I am the dark I'll let this run. of the Sith. The power of the light will always be stronger than the dark side. Still, still spouting the wisdom of the Jedi, I see. Maybe there is more truth in their code than I ever believed. I, I cannot help but wonder, Revan, what would have happened had our positions been reversed. What if fate had decreed that I made it. would be captured That's by actually the Jedi? Good thought. Could I return to the light? As you did. <laughs> if you had not led me down the dark path in the first place. So now place, you're blaming me? What destiny would I have found? I'm sorry I started you on this path, but you cho but you chose to I continue suppose, down it. I suppose you speak the truth. I alone must accept responsibility for my fate. I wanted to be master of the Sith and ruler of the galaxy. But that destiny was not mine, Revan. <laughs> it might have been yours, perhaps. But never mine. And in the end, as the darkness takes me, I am nothing. Oh, you died, bummer. Wah. Oh, I look so tight. Crap, I did not know I did not think I could do that all in one take without saving. I mean without saving uh continually or going back to my saves. That was really cool. But I would advise people if you are wondering if you have problems, save whenever you think you're doing well or you've gotten some good hits. 
and I didn't I wasn't able to destroy the canisters because I didn't have enough dark side powers but if you have dark side powers you can destroy them it makes that battle a heck of a lot easier there you are what happened Darth Malak is dead it's over finally that's wonderful news yes it is there's no time to celebrate just yet I was able to use my battle meditation to allow the Republic to break through the Sith fleet the capital ships are in bombardment range and that means we all have to get out of here right now before this entire complex comes down around our ears. Everyone else is already on the ship. Let's move. Alright guys, Pigeon 88 I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out.